degrees. We have two birds. Each bird is opening their beak differently. How can we figure out whose beak is opened wider? We would have to measure the angles. But how can we measure angles? How would we measure this angle? Or this one? Or this angle? What units do we use? We would use degrees. Imagine a circle divided into 360 equal parts. An angle created by 1 over 360 of the circle measures 1 degree. Two parts out of 360 equal parts would create 2 degrees, and so on. Remember, angles can be any number between 0 and 360. Let's take a look at an example. We're given 20 out of 360 parts of a circle. We need to find how many degrees that's equal to. To do that, we look at the numerator. In this example, the numerator is 20. So the measurement of the angle is 20 degrees. Let's do another one. We have 60 out of 360 equal parts. We need to find the measurement of the angle. We look at the numerator, 60. So the measurement of the angle is 60 degrees. How many degrees is one-tenth of a circle? To figure out the measure of the angle in degrees, we have to create an equivalent fraction with a denominator of 360. To get 360 in the denominator, we need to multiply 10 by 36. Remember, we have to do the same thing to the numerator. So 1 times 36 gives us 36. Now we have 36 over 360. To find the degrees, we have to look at the numerator. The numerator is 36, so the measure of the angle is 36 degrees. Let's do another example. How many degrees is one-third of a circle? First, we have to create an equivalent fraction with a denominator of 360. We multiply both the denominator and the numerator by 120. This gives us 120 over 360. To find the measure of the angle in degrees, we have to look at the numerator. The numerator is 120, so the measure of the angle is 120 degrees. Let's take a look at some of the most common angles and their degree measurements. The first one is the right angle. A right angle is the same as one-fourth of a circle. One-fourth is equal to 90 over 360. So a right angle has the measure of 90 degrees. Now let's take a look at half of a right angle. Half of a right angle is equal to 1 over 8, like a slice of pizza. 1 eighths is equal to 45 over 360, so the measure of this angle is 45 degrees. Take a look at the straight angle. A straight angle is equal to one half of a circle. One half is equal to 180 over 360. So the measure of this angle is 180 degrees. Another common angle is 3 fourths of a circle. 3 fourths is equal to 270 over 360, which gives us a measurement of 270 degrees. And finally, we have the whole circle, which is equal to 4 fourths. 4 fourths is the same as 360 over 360, giving us a measurement of 360 degrees. If you thought this video was helpful, please leave a like. 
For more videos like this, please subscribe.